Actually, it's quite easy to uh, to get the right face on the object. Um, again, this is a video mostly just for me. I uh, pity the fool who will use a reference point between. Um, I'm going to import my object. Set my press N. Bring up my properties. Clip into something really low. Tap to bring up the wireframe. And uh, if I actually now go to um, my UVs, did a smart UV project, you'll see it's all messed up. Oops, uh, what I'm going to do is just unselect everything and then uh, do selection with a bounding box. Come on. Oh, 4.5 in there, and okay. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to do a selection with a bounding box. Um, of these and then also select oops I should have faces first oopsie oops another bounding box hmm. okay that is all of the faces that I want yeah so if I do uh Oops, don't do that. Uh, just hit them all up normal and then recalculate. Then tell it to do a smart UV project. Uh, bring this up in my UV image editor. You see this is still wrong at this point. Um, if I do a clear seam, then uh, flip direction. And then a smart UV project. You see that's still wrong. Flip direction again. UV wrap. So it, it's whenever I do um smart uv project if i just do a straight unwrap it's fine so then if i went uh so if i hit this up and did uvs export and drop that to say one dot png and then open that in gimp and do file uh ah uh, bollocks to it um and just write on it. Okay, and then uh, save a copy. Fuck it, just overwrite it. It's gonna have the lines and stuff on, but you're gonna get an idea. But it's what it is. Um, and then I just bring up the node editor. Go to my cycles. Changes to rendered. Uh, Click use. Oh, it's need a new material. Um, gonna just give it a name. It is add texture, image texture. Like that in there. Bring the color across. Open the file. Desktop one. Let you see. It's pretty much working. Don't know why there's some weird artifacts down there. Um, I'm not sure we're getting, why we're getting weird artifacts, but you can see the the text is applied as we expected it to. If I bring up the GIMP again, looks pretty much exactly how it should look. Um, yeah, I don't know why the artifacts are coming on, but something or nothing. But just uh, it's doable what we want to do. So 